We spend much time featuring wrestlers who succeed, yet equally gripping are those who don't. Or in his case, those who really don't. So many bouts did a young Yuki Morikawa lose that he was renamed after a racehorse loved for never winning. That horse was Haru Urara, who came to have events named after him. His ring name is Mori Urara, alongside which goes the record-breaking run of 38 losing scores post-debut. May 2022 saw the veteran seek just a 12th winning score from 113 tries. Mori Urara was described as shy and clumsy when joining at 15, unable to wash dishes, and famously dropping Osuna Arashi's phone in the bath. And despite having fought since elementary school, he was awful at sumo, losing even to the child Oho after eight years of professional training. But the national sport is the broadest of tents with room for every willing Japanese, regardless of skill. So long as Mori tearfully declines to quit, in response to many suggestions, he must be allowed to stay and highlight the beauty of Sumo's multi-layered form. Mori began this Rare Division 5 outing due to overloading of the bottom tier by waddling straight into this uppercut and wishing he hadn't. He was then hit by a right arm block for that familiar reversing feeling. But his reward was a fight with fellow loss machine Sawai Samu, all 45 years of him, making for half a century of combined professional experience, none of it above this level. And a confident Mori wedged his right inside, dug in the shoulder, pointed that knee, and drove on for his 11th straight win over this lifeless foe. He then beat Itako Zakura on day 7, a match I regrettably missed due to work elsewhere. But the better his score, the better the foe he must fight. Well, just. Shishimaru hitting four wins for just the third time since 2018. Kirimaru, meanwhile, being two years older, turned pro two years earlier. He also has never cleared this level in 21 years, but has far more wins than Moriurara. And the ex Yokozuna barely kept a straight face with regards to both. Unkindly, for sure, but he knows their own stables mock them more. And it's through bearing that harsh setup for so long that Moriurara commands our respect. And he puts up many good fights with his unusual breaststroke defense. As the last man recruited by the great Taiho, of course, he has unique honor 
to defend 